So can you share with us the story of your move to Ecamm and, and why? Yeah, so you really got me into live streaming, you and David, and I'd be forever grateful. <laughs> and what I felt like I got in that was not only a great live streaming studio, but a friendship with both of you. And oh, that was yeah, you know, absolutely. pretty awesome all by itself. <laughs> And so you you've been to Franklin, where I live, Franklin, mm -hmm. Tennessee. You've been to our to our home a couple of times, and you know it's just been it's been awesome. But one of the things I'm I'm not a big fan of is PCs, you know. And I'm not <laughs> like like I know that for some people they're they're awesome, yeah. you know. And I think it's all what you get used to. But for me, I just got tired of having to go back and forth between the world of Mac and the world of PC. And I found that that Ecamm works the way I think. Mm, and so yes. it was love at first sight. When I first tried it, at your encouragement, I went, oh my gosh. I mean, it took me a uh, maybe a day to kind of understand how scenes work. And I'd sort of replicated that in vMix. And initially I thought, well, I'll build this studio as an Ecamm studio in my office, and I'll leave the vMix studio upstairs in my home. But then the more I thought about it, the more I thought, no, nah, that makes sense. So I'm, I'm in the process, as I told you before we got on, on the show today, I'm in the process of converting my main studio to an Ecamm studio as well.